Hello everyone, Kevin Stevenson here with uh, Phase Logics. You can find us at GetMeTheGeek.com and today we're going to talk about alternatives to Zoom meetings. If you're like me, you've been in Zoom meetings a lot lately. Zoom has also been in the news a little bit lately uh, with security issues and things such as that. So I pulled up uh, my browser here and as you can see, you type in security issues. There's NPR and CNN and people talking about some problems where I'm not going to get into the problems that Zoom has. You know, here's here's a Forbes article about Zoom and and security and leaking and things like that. So um, feel free to look at that all you want. Uh, all I'm here talking about is an alternative to Zoom. So I've got two alternatives for you. The first one is Jitsi, which is an excellent choice. Uh, one of the things I like about Jitsi is it's open source conferencing software and, and it's free. So one of the questions you get asked yourself, well, if it's free, how is it making money? Well, are they are they selling advertising and selling stuff? No, I don't believe so. What they're doing here is built on Jitsi. So 8x8, Comcast, and some of these others you see here are basically patrons of the Jitsi project. Uh, ABA is integrating that product into their own VoIP product that they sell. So if you're a, an 8x8 customer and you use a meeting software that's the 8x8 stuff, it is this product. Um, it may be slightly rebranded or whatever, but same thing. So getting started on this is pretty straightforward. All you got to do is go to start a call. Now up here at the top, there's a start a call. And then there's a big button down here, start a call. So you can just simply click on that, give your meeting a name, and there's also a Chrome extension, looks like. So let's just go ahead and give it a meeting name, YouTube test So that's kind of a long one, but you know, whatever. And then you click go. So in this case, um, here is the software. If you've used Zoom, it looks very similar. You've got this little button here, toggles a tile view. Um, you can share your desktop. Uh, you can raise your hand. You see that puts a little raise your hand thing over here. Um, there's a chat window. Where you can add that in there. Um, so that's basically all the normal things you see in um, Zoom. Now, so I've got uh, stuff going on here. So let me let me just show you, like, to turn on the camera here. So I'll go to my camera and flip it on here. And whoa, <laughs> you're going to see this wackiness because of my camera coming on here. The other thing you want to do is add a password to your to your uh, call um, because the URLs for these are pretty straightforward so you see this meet and then the meeting name that I created so I'm gonna go ahead and add a password add password called get me the geek guess my password so now no one can get into this meeting without that password um, honestly, it, all these um, meeting software, you should be using a password just because you don't have any people bombing in there. <laughs> kind of like photo bombing, if you will. So um, let me just show you how we'll get on my phone here. Let me, uh, sir, I'm going to get this phone right here. And I'm going to take a look at this. So let's go ahead and open it up. And so all I need to do is open it up and type in the room and then it's going to ask you for the password. All right, let me switch you back over. There I am. And, and this, uh, you can see a video. Uh, if I turn this video on, you're going to see both of us in there. And, uh, that's basically how it works. Um, if you noticed, I did not have to sign in or anything as far as the, uh, the, the desktop software is concerned. So that's a good thing. So we'll check it out. Um, and now that is Jitsi. Now we're going to talk about the next one. Let's get that started. Now, 
Last thing I want to say here is at the end of your meetings, you do get you do get a little ad um, for eight by eight services. So um, honestly, that's not that bad as far as I'm concerned. So let's uh, check out the next. One. So our next product is called Skype. What? Yeah, everybody's heard of Skype, right? Well, Skype just recently created a new feature called Skype meetings. So let me go and I will show you that here. All right, Skype. So you go to skype.com and you can download Skype, but there's a new thing that says meet now on Skype. So now you can just go create a meeting on Skype, just like that. Create a free, free meeting link. Here's the link which you would type into your uh, that you would send out to everybody start your call so everything else is the same um, let me just turn off the video here so you can just see this um, and mute that too just because now you can go full windowed or, or float or all this other stuff you've got a chat just like you did in the other products and um, and let me just do this and then there's a share screen and you can pick which screen to share and so on the other machine they should see the share shared screen and they do so let me just go on to the other one and I will share that screen one second there you have it I have shared the screen over there on the Mac that's connected to this so you can see my my Mac over there and then you can see the stop screen sharing you can do reactions which is a little bit more than what you get from uh, zoom and then uh, you know if you need to uh, mess with the video and the audio stuff it's here you can turn off incoming videos you can even turn on subtitles uh, one of the cool things about the Skype stuff is that it will do um, transcriptions on the demand. So uh, if I do that, you know, that you should start seeing the transcriptions come up. That is basically all there is to, to Skype one. Um, is Skype, there's a little bit, kind of a little bit more hoops you have to jump through than the Jitsi one. Um, if you have already have a Skype account or Microsoft account, then you're pretty much golden. You can just sign in with those. Um, part of my difficulties had to do with the fact that I'm doing screen recordings at the same time. So, um, yeah. Anyway, uh, that's all I have for you. Uh, these are two great alternatives for Zoom if you're looking for something different. Thanks for joining me.